Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today I will show you how to paint these beautiful tulip flowers that do without a drawing. It will be a loose painting. So let's get started. You all might have seen tulip flowers. They have these inner petals covered by the outer petals. So here I will go from outward to inward. I draw a big round U shape. We write U like this, but here it's rounded U. Now let me show you how to position them in different direction. This one is facing upward. I will draw one facing the left. Facing bottom right and facing towards the top right. It has long broad leaves. Keeping all this in mind, we will start with our painting. Materials I am using our Bristol mop brushes. It comes with size 2, 4, 8, and this is size 0. I am using Bristol watercolor paper and Camel Artist watercolor cakes. I'll paint as per our drawing. First, I paint the big round U. Take your paint very light by thinning it with enough water. Always try to go from light color to dark color. Build your desired color value by adding layers one after the other. Now I am taking crimson color, thinning it with little water and applying it to the tip of the flower. Slowly spread it downwards. Repeat the same process for the second tulip.
for the third tulip i'll paint it pointing downwards look at the first tulip the color is dull when it is dry whereas the second one is having bright shiny color as it is still wet so let's paint the third tulip repeat the same process I will add few more petals to the first tulip. With light yellow I paint the stems later I apply sap green I layer them till I get the desired color value I like to blend the base of the flower with the stem. Repeat the same process for the third stem. Now I am painting the leaves and trying to position them. Tulip leaves are long and broad, pointed at the tip. I'm pushing the leaf behind the stems by adding dark colors.
A little amount of viridian hue color is used for the leaves. You can use viridian hue or emerald green or any green. It is just to add a little variation. You can see I have used a little crimson color to the leaves. It is just to make it more interesting. Now to make it even more interesting and to have fun, I am tapping few crimson and green color. But since I didn't like those tiny drops, I did a wash over it and now as the paper was wet, I got big drops and splashes all over my painting. I thoroughly enjoyed creating this art piece. Hope you too had fun and learned how to do this beautiful painting. Do try out and let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching till the end. See you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.